and again with this strap connection that I'm telling you about it's that's the downside to straps like this hi everybody welcome back to my channel today I am going to show you the coach Hutton crossbody she's in chalk and brass isn't she pretty so I am just going to be showing you um, what fits inside show you some mod shots how she held up um, some pros and cons. So if you are interested, stay tuned. So again, this is the Coach Hutton in chalk. This was $350. And again, it's in chalk and brass hardware. So the description on the site says, Turn timeless on its head, Hutton is a modern day icon with sleek hardware and a fresh take on our iconic turnlock closure. This refined leather saddle bag has room for all your must haves and an adjustable strap for shoulder and crossbody wear. As the description says, it's made out of refined calf leather and the lining is actually fabric. I've been noticing all of the coach bags that I've gotten out um, on the retail site have been fabric and not suede or leather, but it sure looks a lot and feels a lot like suede. For the dimensions, this bag is seven inches high seven and three quarter inches long and three inches wide. The adjustable strap is also 21 and a half inches long. So this bag was out of stock for a little bit, but it looks like it's back in stock. So if you guys want to check it out, it's lovely. And I really like the big floppy flap. I love this style for the turn lock as well, the rectangular style of the turn lock with the coach logo on it. It's a great dupe to the Celine box bag, as you can see with the rectangular shaped lock. Although with the Celine bag, I think it has like a hook. I think it has like a little like hook that comes out that you pull, but I'm always afraid it's gonna catch on to something. So this one probably wouldn't catch on to anything. The thing is, I didn't like the way this looked on me as much as I thought. It looked a little too casual. And it could be because it's white as well. It didn't seem to go with my type of clothes either. But the straps are very nice and comfortable. And again, they're, they're adjustable. So this type of strap connection isn't my favorite because, you know, when you're moving it around and taking it off your back, on your sh off your shoulder, you have to like put this back down or there are definitely a lot of bags that are a lot worse than this. This actually isn't too terrible. So let's move on to what fits in here. So it looks like it should be pretty roomy. There's two compartments here, one really big one, one slender one, and a zip one right here. Oops. This flap is very floppy. It keeps hitting the camera. I don't know what color this is, but it's kind of like a camel sort of an interior. Okay, so I'm going to see if a full-size wallet will fit in here, which I doubt. That is gonna be a no. 
So no full size wallet can fit in here, but a card holder could fit. I would probably put the card holder in here. Maybe not, maybe the card holder. Well, yes, that would work. I have my key pouch and let's see if this mini pochette will fit in here. It does. So I'm filming with my iPhone XS, so I'll just use this case as an, as an example. I think there's a back slip pocket actually, I forgot to mention. Yes, so I can slip it in here. closes up fine and again with this strap connection that I'm telling you about it's that's the downside to straps like this but it fits great I also have my old iPhone 7 plus here and it fits an iPhone 7 plus great now let's see if it can fit my sunglasses. It definitely won't be able to fit my sunglasses case, but will it fit my pouch? Yes, it does. Cause I don't think there's anything down. Yes, there is. There's my key pouch in there and it fits fantastic. I think I might want it in maybe a black or if they ever come out with like a saddle or a camel color, but I don't think the white works for me. If you like a more casual look, a very casual look and a super minimalist look, or you really love the Celine box bag, but you can't justify paying, I think three, $4,000 for it. This is a great alternative. And it, the quality is great. Again, this was $350. Great quote quality as usual. And it can fit basically everything that I need, including this mini pochette, which is, I was actually surprised I actually hadn't tried it yet. So I'm very surprised that it fits everything in here. So anyway, stay tuned for some mod shots and I will catch you guys later. Bye.